Same day George Floyd is laid to rest, a powerful message takes shape in Uptown Charlotte. More than a dozen artists spent the day painting this mural on South Tryon Street. As you can see here, it reads Black Lives Matter. WCNC Charlotte's Ashley Daly has been there all day. Ashley, we hear crowds of people have also been stopping by all day to witness the mural being painted. Yeah, Sarah, but first take a look at these artists. They have been here since 830 this morning and are just now putting the final touches on these letters. But as you were mentioning the crowds, the crowds have been gathering all day as well. A lot of people coming to take pictures and videos. A lot of parents bringing their kids along as well, making this a teachable moment. We've also saw a lot of people talking with the artists, a lot of artists whom you might recognize their work. <laughs> For Charlotte artist Kyle Mosier, images are powerful. His larger-than-life murals seen all across Charlotte from South End to Noda. So the big one right now would be Instagrammable moments. So you want to have those moments where people can sort of uh, capture a feeling or a mood. But this week, Mosier's work went from Instagrammable to historic when he became one of 17 local artists asked to participate in this mural in Uptown. With individual strokes, together, the artist painted for nine hours straight, creating this, a mural spanning an entire city block from 3rd to 4th Street along South Tryon. You can feel it. It's, it's um, palpable. We're, this is something that's going to be written about in history books. But Charlotteans won't have to wait until it's published in a book. Today, many stopping to see, to feel, and to reflect on why these three words were painted in the first place. And for parents, today, an opportunity to teach. That there are lives that have been mistreated for so long, oppressed for so long, that just hurt, deserve to be hurt. The city says the paint being used is the same traffic paint used by DOT, making the mural a permanent image, sending a message from the heart of a city. Now the city says they the city says they plan to put up a drone later this evening once all of this wraps up and it's at that point when we might get a final pit, big picture of what exactly this mural looks like with all of these letters together. Uh, we're also told this street is expected to still be on schedule to reopen at 7 this evening. Again, this is South Tryon Street in Uptown. Reporting live, Ashley Daly, WCNC Charlotte. I can't wait to see it, Ashley. Thank you. Fred, over to you. Okay, Sarah.